Hello friends, in this video we will discuss about lifespan and their several aspects. So first, what is the definition? This is given here, period from birth to natural death of an organism, this is considered as lifespan. Here we have to be very strict from birth to natural death of an organism. Death may also be accidental or because of disease or illness but that death is not considered a part of lifespan here again birth to natural death of any organism now by the example suppose for human beings after birth if death occurs at the age of 10 years or 20 years or 30 years because of any disease or accident that is not considered it's natural lifespan so lifespan again birth to natural death of any organism for human beings for other animals for other plants this is variable means lifespan is variable for organism to organism there are few points regarding lifespan that are very important given here first plants generally have greater lifespan with respect to animals this is given also by the example in next point second point is lifespan varies from one day to thousand years here for mayfly for cicada insect lifespan is nearly one day while for people sequoia the lifespan is variable this may be up to thousand or more than thousand years also sometime Third point, lifespan of an organism is not correlated with their body size. This point is very very important. There is no correlation in organism with respect to body size. This is given here by the examples. First crow and parrot. They both are nearly same in their body size. But for crow, the lifespan is nearly 15 years. While for parrot, this is 140 years mango and people again they are nearly same in body size but huge difference in their lifespan for mango this is nearly 200 years sometime maybe also more than 200 while for people this is more than 200 to 300 years as we discuss here people lifespan may also be thousand or thousand plus years third is again from animal side elephant and tortoise now here there is huge difference in their body size but if we discuss about their lifespan this is just opposite like in elephant their body size is very great but lifespan is 75 years while for tortoise their body size is very small with respect to elephant but here their lifespan is very huge with respect 100 to 150 years there is no individual which is immortal except single celled ones for example this is about amoeba or other any unicellular organism so all individuals that are multicellular they have a fixed lifespan as we already discussed lifespan is variable but for unicellular organism we cannot consider about their natural death why reason is given here when unicellular organism matures divide into two equal daughter cells and when they are getting divided at that time nothing is left behind means no body part is left behind to die so stages of lifespan so four points are given here just these are four stages in lifespan of any individual organism the first is juvenility here what is juvenility so definition is given here we can simply say before the age of reproduction duration of life just before capability to produce gametes that duration is known as juvenility second maturity when reproduction begins reproduction is started by any organism this is just because of gamete formation from that that point we can say that organism is in its maturity period third is aging and senescence simply both are synonymous we can say but there is a minor difference 
that we can discuss here in the points first is about aging so progressive deterioration of body means here body activities or vital activities or metabolic activities of body is progressively declining with increasing age that is known as aging while in senescence there is terminal irreversibility of all these vital activities means if a person is in aging reversal of metabolic activities may be but when reversal is impossible at that condition we can say the organism falls in senescence life life span and finally the fourth one is death what is the death so permanent cessation or permanent arrest of all metabolic activities that causes death next factors affecting life span what are the factors that may affect life span so there are a number of factors few of them are just given here genetic composition what type of genetic composition present in organism metabolic rate higher metabolic rate usually decreases life span while slow metabolic rate usually increases life span habitat habitat may be rough habitat may be favorable food quality what kind of food is consumed by that particular organism etc there are so many factors but these are few that may favors or that may decreases life span of any individual organism now in ncert there is a page and in that page approximate life span of some organism are just given so here this is for elephant and rest of the organism so one by one if we discuss about their life span for elephant this is nearly 75 years as we already discuss when we compare elephant when we compare elephant with tortoise second is about rose so its life span is nearly 10 years for dog its life span is nearly 25 years for butterfly this is already given here 1 to 2 weeks for crow 15 years for banana tree this is nearly again 25 years for cow again 25 years parrot 140 years crocodile 60 years horse this is nearly 50 years fruit fly this is nearly 1 month rice plant nearly 4 month tortoise given here 100 to 150 years and for banyan tree this is nearly 3 hour summarized here in this portion so butterfly fruit fly rose crow cow dog banana horse up to banyan tree these all are arranged here in increasing pattern increasing increasing period of their life span